Respectfully, Your Excellency. What can I do for you? Governor Burren asked me to investigate the abductions the rebels told us about. If we could find the origin and free their comrades, I'm sure they would stop their attack. I need to locate and speak with the other rebels. Do you know where they could be? No. They don't attack often. I fear they're gathering their forces. Captain, the patrol we sent to the west has not returned yet. I may have spoken too quickly, Your Excellency. Although it might still be possible that our men are just delayed. Perhaps you would allow me to search for them. Maybe they cross paths with the rebels. Corporal, do you know which way the patrol went? Of course, Captain. You will lead, His Excellency. In hope that our men are still alive. At your command, Captain. Your Excellency, find me at the entrance of the camp when you're ready to start. Are you ready to go, Your Excellency? Yes, let's go. any time. Is that the patrol we're looking for? Yes. That's them. More victims of these savages. But two of the soldiers are missing. Maybe they managed to escape. They'll surely need help. We should look for them.
in trouble! Please help me! This man needs to be cared for. But in his condition, we can't take him back to the outpost. Allow me. There. That should be better. <sighs> Thank you, sir. Without your help, I would probably have died here. <sighs> Tell us what happened. We came across a group of rebel savages. It was a massacre. A few seconds later, only Franz and I were left. We fled. I managed to drag myself here, but he was not so lucky. The savages caught up with him. Was he captured? Did you see where they took him? They headed north to Frazonegan. But in the state I was in, I didn't see much else. Your Excellency, please. We should get him out of there. They're bound to torture and kill him. We'll take care of it, Corporal. The rebels must have left traces when dragging the prisoner. But not you. You must help your wounded man to reach the outpost. Come on. There's our group of rebels. The soldier they captured looks dead. Let's go, My name is De Sade. I'm the legate of the congregation. I'm here because I want to talk to your chief. I know who you are. The Renaixe on all Manawi. What do you want to say to Armal? I want to talk to him about the abductions and to understand what's going on. You would be the first Renaixe to care. How do we know you're not just saying that to find out where our camp is? I am not part of the Alliance. My only goal is to avoid deaths on both sides. Help me. I am your only chance to free your prisoners without bloodshed. You seem to really believe what you say. I hope I'm not mistaken. Very well. Tell me when you are ready to follow me to our camp. Are you ready to follow me, Ranaikse? Let's go. This way.
Let's stay on guard. The rebels are not after us. I doubt they'll have set a trap. This way. I'm letting my comrades know we're here so that they let us pass. Follow me. We are almost there. It's this way. Come on. This is our main camp. This is why you will find Arnal. I hope I am not wrong to lead you here, and that you are not a traitor. So, here's the famous rebel camp. I hope their leader can tell us more about these abductions. And what are you doing here, Anaikse? My name is Desarde. I'm the legate of the merchant congregation. I came to talk to you about the abductions and your forthcoming attack. And how did you find our camp? I convinced one of your men to bring me. Well, I'll tell you what we know, then you'll understand why we have to fight lions. Many seasons ago, Sinol Manawi started to disappear. Lions attacked the villages and took them with them. We never saw them again. They were either crazy or so injured that even our best Donegad couldn't do anything. So we counterattacked and captured some of their soldiers. And we learned that they were taking our people to a place they call a laboratory. It is there that they torture and kill them. They talked about Experiments. Experiments? So that was the reason for all these abductions. But what do they hope to discover? Alert! The lions are attacking! Traitor! It was you who led them to us! No, I swear. They asked me to investigate. It was never a question of attacking you. Then prove it! Fight with us! The Alliance betrayed me as much as you. I owe them nothing.
Your Excellency. Lord Dasan. And to what do I... I have returned in the hope that you... I'm still waiting for you to... I see. Would you like to speak with me about any... I have to go. Look forward... Farewell, to... my lord. Hello, Glenda. Birt Tirtomad on all Menawi. What can I do for you? To tell you that men are going to come all the way to the sanctuary. Some Renaigse. I thank you for coming to warn me in person. But our High King has already spoken to me. I am disgusted to welcome warriors of the faraway island. But the decision is not mine. And in truth, we do not have the choice, do we? No. It is all of Tirfredi and Enon Mil Frichtemen that's in danger. We have need of every able warrior to protect them. You need to prepare yourself as well. I fear that you will not be spared. We will fight, have no doubts. Because such is our duty and our will. These are our lands that are attacked. I have no doubt. Good luck, Glenda. May the rocks give you their toughness. You shall need it more than everyone else. Can I do anything else for you? I must leave. Goodbye. Qua awelem seg. Who are you? When I, I came, I, I convinced. Well, men, Lord, they were so weak. And it is expert. Alert! Treat! No, then I, prove! 
Your men have killed too many settlers. You! Bit of poison on my brain! Let's see if you can walk this fight! Move away! Things are about to get dancing! used us to locate the camp and get rid of the rebels. And this is not the first time we've been victims of this double dealing. Let's go and find Buren. It's time he learned that we're not his pawns. As for this laboratory, I intend to discover what it contains. Lord Desade, what? Enough with the formalities, Excellency. You owe me an explanation. Did you order your troops to attack while I was negotiating under a white flag? I assure you that I have no idea what you are talking about. I would never have placed your life in harm's way. The alliance with the congregation is crucial, and you know it. Your suspicions are unfounded. I'm sorry. It is now clear that decisions are being made without my consent. I'm going. You mock me, Excellency. I can't believe this matter slipped your vigilance. 
Everything the Danaea Exregal have told me has proven true. Your men attacked and carried off natives. I witnessed it. According to what I've been told, they are taken to a place where experiments are carried out, where they are tortured. I... It is true that I knew of the existence of this laboratory. The place is dedicated to research on the Malachor. If a remedy is ever to be discovered, it will happen there. But I assure you that I was not aware that natives were being taken there. Allow me to doubt your sincerity, Excellency. I intend to pay the place a visit and see for myself what happens there. Who directs the research? Our most brilliant savant, the Doctor Asili. Certainly his legend precedes him. He is the master of your friend, the Professor Afra. Would you like to speak with me about any other subjects? I have returned in the hope that you might have changed your mind. I'm still waiting for you to earn my... Tr I see. I Would you like to speak with... I have to go. Look forward to... Farewell, my lord. You speak to the legate of the merchant congregation, soldier. I have been sent by Governor Burren. I have to talk to Dr. Asili. I don't take orders from the governor, nor the congregation. Be on your way. He won't obey me either, Greenblood. He's not from my regiment. Sorry, soldier, but I'm coming in, whether you like it or not. To arms! A bit of poison on my blade. And let's go! Move away! like this in here there must be other guards be careful They've been reduced to burning the bodies. How many have they killed?
I don't have the key. It's blocked. I don't have the key. A bit of poison on my blade. Then let's go! don't have the key.
I need a bit of practice. Blasts, you'll find the quintessence of power. We'll the make you dance, the... land dwellers. <laughs> <laughs> Poison on my blade. Then let's go! <laughs> Thank you. 
You're not one of them. Please, get us out of here. Not? What are you doing locked up here? These scientists captured and abused us. They performed experiments, made us drink potions, took our blood. I heard them say that they wanted to find out how we are immune to the Malachor. None of it makes any sense. Please, get us out of here. I'll find a way to open this cage. What they did to all those prisoners, to my brothers, was revolting. Let's hold this good doctor to account. Let's go now. Oi. Just one moment. I haven't freed all the prisoners yet. Now that they are free, we must help the prisoners escape this place. They can't leave through the city. The guards will stop them, or worse. So we have to find another way to get them out.
These poor people lost their lives only a few hours ago. They could not survive this mutilation. If only we'd known sooner. This note carefully describes the sequence of the experiments. There are even sketches. It's hard not to feel sick. This is... I don't have the key. A silly has locked himself in his office. If he thinks he can escape us like that, let's find the key. I don't have the key. I don't have the key. Are you? You have no right to be here. I have come to free your prisoners and put an end to all the horrors that take place here. <sighs> I knew this would happen eventually. This all went too far. Dr. Asili, he, uh, he lost his mind a long time ago. But what are you going to do with us? Arrest you. Then I expect you will be sentenced. <sighs> no, please. We only followed the doctor's orders. We tried to stop him. But he is the director of the lab. You could have reported it to the governor or left this place. He threatened to destroy our lives. We could not... Please, don't look us up. You can say all of this in court. It's up to them to judge you. <sighs> they will want to make an example of us. We'll not see the light again. You should have thought about that before helping that monster. And under what right do you enter here? I am the legate of the merchant congregation, and I'm here to put an end to your crimes. My crimes? What are you talking about? My work was for the good of humanity. Don't tell me you're crying over some savages. The survival of our species requires sacrifice. What did you hope to find from all these experiments? Since the Malachor never reached this island, I wanted to check if these savages were sensitive to it. And I discovered that they were naturally resistant. Do you realize the implications of this discovery? So I tried to isolate this resistance to develop a cure in order to send it to the people on the continent. 
but I doubt that you will be able to understand the subtlety of such an approach. Why do you bother with the Norse? You are known to be immunized too. I wanted to check the reality of such a statement. To be precise, this is not the case. You are actually more resistant. How many of my people did you have to slaughter to reach that conclusion? We learned everything we wanted to know. This lab will close and you will answer for everything you have done. You think so? Gods, capture these people! A bit of poison on my blade. And let's go! <laughs> Stop! Think of my knowledge. All that I have accomplished. That can never disappear. You will answer for your crimes in court. But I'll be out soon. My colleagues will understand the importance of my work. We shall see about that. It's perfect. We just have to clear the way. Let's go. I found a way out of the city. But be careful. You are weakened. And creatures roam these tunnels. I will lead the way. There you are. You're free. You have saved our lives. How can we thank you? We will never forget what you have done for us on Al Manawi. Yes, we will always be grateful. We're not very far from the Hikmet outpost. You will have to be careful. I know how to reach the port without being seen. Perfect. As for you, you should take refuge in Vikshadir. 
You will be safe there, but you should avoid the Alliance patrols. We'll get there. Qua awal and segven. Your Excellency, Lord Dusade, and to what do I owe this honor? I've been to Asili's laboratory, and what I discovered was abominable. Hundreds of poor souls tortured, victims of horrifying experiments. There were so many dead that a pit had been dug to burn the bodies. How horrifying. I cannot believe it. The natives were not the only victims of these crimes. There were also a number of noughts. Noughts? Pardon me for doubting you, but do you have proof of what you say? And have you brought Dr. Asili to me so he may answer these accusations? Yes, we captured him. Really? Very well. I will ensure that he is judged as quickly as possible. What was done with the prisoners that were being held in the laboratory? They were freed. The Denea Exregau are satisfied and should call off their attack. What a relief. Finally, some good news. How can I repay you? By allowing me to take part in the trial proceedings. What I saw merits justice, and I fear that the accused will find a great many defenders amongst his fellow savants. It is a rather novel request, but granted. I shall inform the prosecutor. Let us remember that the madness of a man should not cast a shadow upon the greater sum of his work. His research is perhaps our only chance of discovering a remedy. Would you like to speak with me about any other subjects? I have returned in the hope that you might have changed your mind. And you have done well to hope so. You have proven to me that I can trust you. I shall give you the support of my men for the attack on this infamous sanctuary. Thank you, Excellency. I have to go. Look forward to seeing you again. Farewell, my lord.
The cave that Constantine indicated in his note shouldn't be very far. Let's be careful. He probably put some guards at the entrance. Constantine has marked several places on this map. I recognize some of them. They are sacred places for the natives. Places of connection. This place. This journal. My poor Constantine, you have completely lost your mind. What are you hoping to achieve with these rituals? If you want my opinion, once he had a taste of the power of the Donegada, he decided he wanted more. The natives uphold a certain balance for everything they receive. They give back to the island. Your cousin doesn't. So much so that he's threatening Enon Mil Frictum and himself. He wants to take his place. <sighs> to think he's been plotting this absurd plan for weeks. He even used us to achieve it. The intruder in the sanctuary was certainly sent by him to scout the place. We'll need to gather allies if we're going to stop him. But we will also have to weaken him and break apart the bonds that he's established. I don't know exactly how these things work. And unless you do, we're gonna need help. How about Dunkus? Mev scares me a little. You're right. Let's go and find him.
When you see Vad, give him my... That... As I've told you before, my cousin bonded himself in many places before he decided to target the heart of the island. You did tell me, and you must know that by doing so, he has acquired a power that no Donegada has ever possessed. That is why I need your help. We need to break some of his bonds in order to weaken him. Rest assured, all the Donegada will answer to the call of their Hoi King. And with their help, we will heal the wound your cousin has opened. However, to accomplish this, it is I who will need your help. What can I do? During the ritual, the one who is bonding himself spills some of his blood near the base of a stone. And this blood summons a guardian. The guardian lifts the stone so that it may serve as an anchor point for the bond. The only way to break this bond is to have a guardian topple the stone. We will be able to do it, but these rituals take a long time. Too long to be done quickly. So, in the meantime, you must prevent your cousin from drawing magic from the place. Here, take these seeds and plant them at the bottom of your cousin's bonding stones. These plants grow very fast, and their roots will prevent him from drawing the strength of Tifradi. However, you must be careful, because the guardians corrupted by him will come to defend the stones. Thank you, Dunkers. And thank you for wanting to stop your cousin. Don't worry. I will send my people to finish the work of the plants I have given you.
about to get dicey. us at the base of the Ray Stone. Look! The plant seems to be growing extremely fast. The Donnegarda of Dunkus's clan are sure to be here soon to finish breaking the bond. seems to be growing extremely fast. The Donnegarda of Dunkus's clan are sure to be here soon to finish breaking the bond. How are you feeling, my child? What you are about to do is difficult. Don't make it harder than it has to be, Petrus. Fighting against your cousin isn't pleasant, but it's the only logical thing to do. A nicer way of saying he has no choice. Indeed. I must stop Constantine, regardless of what it may cost me. Not only to obtain an antidote to the Malachor, but also to save this island. I have learned many things by your side, and thanks to you, I was able to give my mother back to the Earth. I won't forget this. And this is my land, my people. I will be by your side. You will not go through this ordeal alone. What's happened to Constantine is regrettable. But you're doing what must be done. You're a good person, Greenblood. 
then you can count on your old master of arms to protect you. We will all be with you. After all, this concerns all of us, doesn't it? Naturally. We will be by your side to support you both physically and spiritually. Thank you. You have been precious allies, and you are proving once more the value of your friendship. Now let's go. It'll be a shame if we arrive too late. The entrance to the sanctuary has been forced. A fight took place here. Constantine managed to get through. Let's hurry. Desade, glad to see you. Sadly, we couldn't stop your cousin. He suddenly stormed our position, along with a horde of enraged creatures. We didn't stand a chance. And now there are beasts attacking us relentlessly. My men are doing all they can to stop them. We thought it best to stay here to keep the path open for you, should you want to face your cousin. Thank you. You did well. I'll do everything in my power to catch him and stop him from carrying out his plan. Keep holding on as long as you can. I need to be able to reach him. Wait, there's a group of creatures coming. Maybe in He's right. We must help them stop these creatures. Are you sure? Every minute gained is a minute that allows you to save us. Glad to have you with us, Kurt. Just like the good old days. And thank you too, Afra. It is an honor. Enough with the talking, Greenblood. Go. And stop, Constantine. I'd hate to be doing this for nothing. In that case, thank you. And good luck to both of you. There you are. I was starting to think that we would die here for nothing. Your cousin just passed through here with a horde of beasts, and he keeps sending us more. We won't hold very long. We're not used to fine creatures like these. We are, and we will hold long enough for you to reach the heart, even if we must die in the process. But you must chase him. 
You must prevent him from performing the ritual at all costs. If Enon Milfrichtiman dies, we're all doomed. I'm well aware of that, believe me. But here come some more beasts. To arms! Stay with my people. And I'll stay with her. One blade more can't hurt. We need to prevent the beasts from following your tracks. Yeah, we could use some help here, to be honest. I wouldn't have put it that way, but the Moridigan isn't wrong. You see? Over and done. You should go now. And may the volcano give you its strength. Well, good luck. There you are. Praise the Enlightened. Your cousin... ...has already reached the heart. Our other allies inform me. They are also trying to stop the creatures. What do you intend to do? Pursue him all the way there and do everything I can to stop him. In that case, may the Enlightened keep you in his divine... Oh no. More beasts are coming! Be prepared! I'm staying with my people. I knew you'd say that. Well, I wasn't going to let the young ones get all the glory. Your help would be a blessing, father. You see? You should go now, my child. Be careful. We are all praying for your success. Thank you, Petrus. Be careful, too. <laughs>
Constantine! Restrain him! Sorry. Why? Why have you done this? But for you. For us. So that we may live free at last. This makes no sense. Constantine, it's madness. You don't understand because you're still attached to the old world. This old, dying world which, to survive, has betrayed, used, and manipulated us and would not have hesitated to kill us. Perhaps, but... I've seen death, cousin. 
and I understood the vanity of it all. My father's ruses just so he could earn more power, the political bowing and scraping to preserve corrupted nations. I have been offered unrivaled power, allowing me to get rid of this, to send the old world back to its inevitable death and to build something new here, something unique. And this new world is my gift to you. You and I could be its new gods, the immortal and benevolent monarchs. He himself is the incarnation of the old world he is speaking of. He has its vices and its poison. For his own immortality, he's prepared to destroy everything around him, to break millennia of soikos. I implore you, flesh of my land, think of all the lives that will come to an end to feed his pride. Don't listen to this old god. He's like all the others, after all, clinging to life. All you have to do is to bind yourself here with me, and we will be gods together forever. After the fall of Constantine, my young student managed to establish stronger links between the old nations and the natives. Some of their Donegada were even invited to the continent, and with their help, it slowly became a land filled with life again. And for the first time in a long while, the number of cases of the Malachor is decreasing. Those who bravely fought at Dorhad Genadu were celebrated everywhere. After all, if it weren't for this unlikely alliance, the island would have fallen into Constantine's greedy hands. Zieglinda took Kurt as an advisor, but he insisted on keeping his place alongside his former student and friend, watching his back, as he always had. Siora obtained the title of Marl of the Red Spears, alongside her twin. She leads them with wisdom, but often reunites with the one she still calls her Karantz. Afra set aside her weapons and went back to her research on the native culture and flora of the island. It is said that she is even writing a book with the help of Dunkas's clan when not visiting her friends. For his bravery, Vasco was awarded the rank of commander. He now travels the sea at the head of a whole fleet, but he often comes back to visit his brother-in-arms. Petrus's ambitions have finally been fulfilled. He obtained the much-coveted title of Cardinal. Despite the responsibilities implied by such a title, he still sometimes visits the one he calls his child. Despite the help Ulan received, which allowed him to restore the importance of the seaside Nemeus, he still had to renounce the role of Marl as he faced the contempt of the other clans. Dunkas and his people spent a lot of time with savants and theologians. Patiently, they shared their knowledge of the earth and learned new techniques from one another. 
and in so doing, they restored balance between the new world and the old. The natives' hostility towards the Alliance has not diminished, and Governor Byrne is in a delicate situation, especially considering some sordid rumors in al Sa'd regarding the practices of the scholars he protects. By wanting to convert the natives at all costs, including by force, Teleme's only reward was their anger. Bogged down in the political maneuvers of the missionaries and the Ordo Luminis, San Mateus struggled. Now that the Nort's sailing techniques were known, others tried their hand at them, without success for the time being. Simply knowing the techniques could not take the place of the Guild's centuries of experience. Under Sieglinder's control, the Guard returned to the honorable values that had made its reputation. Despite the negative influence of some shady members in their midst, alas, the Devesp's arrival didn't bring peace to this island. Their scheming left its mark. Some of the people of New Serene still believe the lies they spread. However, the abundance of evidence against Aurelia signaled the end of the Devesp's ambitions. Both, however, the abundance of evidence against Aurelia, where they were harshly reprimanded by the Council, who relegated them to the status of the most obscure families.